let alone a medical business and a retail business. So many of us in the eye care industry are not capitalizing on the opportunity of our opticals because we're not using the data to do so. Brian in Arizona. I'm using a new system that pulls data from an EHR and we get a lot of analytics from it. But honestly, I don't know what to do with all the data. What's this thing? Oh, so we don't save it. Gotcha. Okay. <laughs> yeah, this is a really common issue, right? We're trained how to dial in the most amazing prescriptions, how to craft the best lenses for them, and how that correction will best fit our patient's lifestyle. But we're not taught how to run a business let alone a medical business and a retail business. So many of us in the eye care industry are not capitalizing on the opportunity of our opticals because we're not using the data to do so. So technology now, like with this program, allows for certain services to pull the data for us. Great, but now what? <laughs> this is a common problem. I'm a huge believer in the power of analytics to grow your practice, but if you don't know what to do with the data, then it's of no value to you. On anything in life, that which is tracked will grow. On a foundational level, the things that you want to be tracking in your office are your capture rate, right? The ratio of the exams to the eyewear purchases. Um, your dollar value per patient, your premium lens qualifiers like your anti-reflective percentages, your new patient and established patient quantities. You want to make sure that you have new patients coming in every year, right? That your, that your marketing is working. Then you need to share the data points with your team so that you can improve on it, right? Once you have a kind of a guideline of where you're at, you need to have the team involved so it can be tackled and built upon. We have proven simplified methods of, of success that we teach in depth in Spexy University for these things, but it's something that you can't just track it from a management level and not share it with everybody else. There's no point in doing that. It is a common problem to not know what to do with the data. This is where most eye care professionals in the industry who could afford it would turn to consultants, but that left the vast majority of those who actually needed it in the dust without any help. And that's why we created Spexy, right? To give access and help to those who actually need it.